all running and I've got a terminal session open to my ASA firewall via the rollover cable. In the background I've got my TFTP server running and I am on the same subnet as my firewall so I can copy stuff across. I've got my ASA operating system at ASD um, software downloaded with a valid smartnet from Cisco ready to upload to the firewall. So to actually get them onto the firewall I'm going to do a copy tftp flash command. I'm going to give it the IP address of my laptop that is running the tftp software. And I'm going to give it the name of the file that I'm going to upload. Now because I can't type and I've got a memory like a SIF, what I'll do is I'll just copy that out of there and paste it in there. That's the source, I want the destination to have the same name. Now this can take quite some time and I've speeded it up. Now I've got the operating system across, I also want to copy across the ASDM image. So same command and it will remember the values you gave it before, so I can just hit enter there. Now the source file name is going to be different for the ASDM. So once again I'll just copy the text off there and paste it in there. Destination's gonna have the same name. And once again that'll copy across. Now that's them both them loaded into the flash memory on the firewall, which we can have a look at with a show flash command. There's the old and the new operating systems, 831 and 841, which is the new one we just uploaded. Now, what I'm going to need to do is to set the firewall to boot from the new image. So, the command for that is boot system space disk zero and then the path to the files so it's colon forward slash and then the name of the OS image. Once again, I'm just going to copy and paste that out on there. Paste that in there and hit return. Right, that's it set to boot from the new operating system to load the new ASDM when it's asked for. We need to set the ASDM image with an ASDM image space disk zero and then the path to the ASDM image that we've just uploaded. this will take effect until the firewall has been rebooted so I'm going to issue a reload and reboot the firewall again I've speeded this up ignore the odd errors there that's because I said uh, 3.1 in the config so if I do a short version, you will see right at the top there that we're now happily running version 8.41 with device manager 6.41 below it there and just in case you were in any doubt if I log in, go to enable mode and do a show run ASDM it will show us that we're going to use the new ASDM image if it's asked for and that's done, thanks very much for watching don't forget to come and visit us at www.pnetlife.com